John? Yeah, yeah, hey. Hi, I'm Dr. Taylor Geddes. Yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah. Thanks for seeing me so soon. How are you doing today? Pretty good. Okay, have a seat. Yeah, thank you for having me. Yeah, so like I said on my email, I'm new to the area mm -hmm. and I'm super excited about taking new patients and hopefully next time we're in a, an office. Yeah, I mean, thanks for having me here. I appreciate it. Yeah, so John, we're here to talk about your struggles with pathological lying. Yes. It's a relatively new thing for me. Uh, this whole thing kind of is. How new? Like six years. Tell me more about that. I mean, I don't know. It starts small, you know. Someone asks you like, hey, were you at that show last night? Like, yeah, I was there. It was awesome, you know. But I guess I think a lot about like, what if I was somebody else? I guess one day I just kind of realized you can just tell people that. Who even knows who I am? I don't. Don't tell anyone what I'm about to say. But one time- John, I am so sorry. Let me just grab this. Someone keeps calling me. Okay. Hello? This is she. Okay, okay, okay. All right, I'll be right there. Okay, thank you so much. All right, bye. Okay, we need to go. I'm so sorry. We're gonna cut this short. Okay. And we're gonna go get your shoes on. All right. Let's reschedule okay. tomorrow. Um, oh shit. You did a great yeah. job today. Okay, what is going on? Uh, it's an um, emergency, but you know what? I love the progress and we'll talk, pick it up tomorrow. Let's reschedule. Okay, I'll, I'll call you then. Okay. Bye. through your hair you see my hand when the red dress flows through the air everyone stares what can i say when my words don't seem to work the best part of my day is when you put on my whole shirt and we go dancing in the living room. What are the chances I got to meet you? You are my blue heart, baby. Baby, I want you to save me. Taylor Gettys. I'm Taylor Gettys. Taylor. Taylor Gettys. The H is silent. I'm Taylor Gettys. I'm Taylor Gettys. I'm Dr. Taylor Gettys. Nice to meet you. Well, man, I'll tell you. Guy knocks on my door. Knocks on it. Oh, he's a goddamn internet and cable guy, man. Little Veston orange nose in my business, man. I wasn't gonna have it. Okay. Now, what did the man say to you? What What made you yell at him? Uh, I'm just gonna lay this out for you, man. See, it says it right here, man. I printed it all out, black and white. 5G network coming to your neighborhood. Beware, it will make you gay. It has been proved. Pro proven. Proven. Mm -hmm. So it's real. You know what I mean? It's so real. So real. Turned my cousin gay. Turned my cousin gay. And I synced it. And I love him to death. You know, not like that. You know. That is not uncommon. My fucking mom keeps telling all her friends that I'm emo. I'm attracted to grapes sexually. My dad didn't invite me to Thanksgiving. Do you own a gun? I'm goth. 
When I was a boy, I put a bunch of grapes in my underwear and got a hard on. I suppose that they do look like a bunch of boobs all together, don't they? Well, yes, I guess they do, but I prefer booty. My cousin keeps calling me gay because of 5G. And don't tell anybody this, but I've been gay since 3G. I've been gay back since when the internet did the whole Jeffrey Epstein screwed my wife, man. How old is your wife? And I think I'm gonna prescribe you two Bud Lights and a sit on the back porch. It's not a phase. Well, I think we have made a lot of progress today, but unfortunately that's our time. All in a day's work. <laughs> Taylor Gettys, who the hell are you? Are you familiar at all with the phrase, keep on trucking? Have you ever considered uh, mescaline? I'm so sorry, but reschedule. Good me tomorrow. Uh, Thank you so much. It's all right. Now, be a some bitch if somebody's trying to fuck with you. <laughs> what about the back? Can you see the like chip clip? No. Okay. okay. Do I have a little bit of a smidge one?